Hello there and welcome to Troom Troom Rants. Today, if you read the title, I am going to show you how to change your own mouse cursor literally. Like you can literally change this mouse cursor into a completely different mouse cursor. Uh, so, first of all, I am going to... So go to your search tab thing and all you want to do is you just want to type in mouse so you just type in mouse click mouse settings um don't need to worry about this you go to related settings additional mouse options and then you have the mouse the mouse properties so you go you go to um you go to pointers and now you can select any um any mouse cursor that looks fitting for you so um, busy you've got working in background you've got help select and you've I think that works anyways um, yeah yeah so basically what you want to what you want to do is yeah so normal select so this is just this is just what you have uh, normally what you can do is I normally like uh, doing hand whiting uh, which changes changes your um, changes your mouse cursor and you can see it as well because some of them you actually can't see it until it does the job it needs to do so I don't know like this right here what working in background um, it basically means like you're going on a website and it needs to initialize what's on the web what um it's initializing what's on the website and back in like the windows like 98 you used to have this kind of thing and they put that there as well you've got every single uh thing that does its job and basically you click handwriting Oh, it hasn't done it. Hmm. Oh, actually, I think I know why it isn't doing it. Yeah, I think I know why. So basically, uh, click apply. So what you can do is you can actually click browse, and it can. It. I don't know why, but oh, I don't know why, but it only works on browse for some weird reason. So you've got all of these cursors to select from. Um let's see you have what's this that's a pen eh, you don't really want that you have working it even shows you the gif as well which is cool so these are the ones that look kind of weird this one as you can see this one i'm gonna choose that one i hope it works i think it works so yeah, look, it, it, it changed our mouse cursor. I don't think you might see it on camera, but it did change it. Um, oh, yeah, so basically you can just change your mouse cursor. If you don't like it, then um, you can change it again to another one. So let's see. Let's see what we have here. We have so many to choose from, so you can just go throughout every single one. Does it, would this work? let's see that does do the question mark that's pretty surprising and you can also go um oh that is huge is it okay I'm, I'm just testing things out so yeah uh you have this spinning cursor thing now you won't, won't be able to see it but it, it's right here I'll, I'll tell you that for sure you have these yeah you, ha you also have these cross cross thingies I don't know why you need that, but people say that it's pretty cool to have, which I, I don't know why they need it in the first place. But you can choose pen, these are the pens. Um, person, you've got every single one. You've got, 
you've even got these ones with just the, the um, weight, weight mouse cursor thing. So, um, let's see the one that looks cool. Is it cross? Oh, okay. Yeah, cross. Um, those are just that. Let's see. Hmm. Th th that's the normal one right there, so. Hmm. Let's see. I'm gonna choose that one. Why not? And now it becomes your cursor. You won't be able to see it, but whatever. And what else? You can also change. So when you like, what do you call it? When you like hover onto something, you can even change that. I know it's pretty weird. Um, let's see. You've got person. You don't really need that. Um. Hmm. The the ones that look like these. Those are the normal ones there. Hmm. You can change it. I think. You can change it to the, a bigger one, which is weird. And now we just, now we just, that looks weird. Oh no, I don't want that. Um, hmm. Let's go all the way to the bottom. See what we have. We have that, that, we have that. That's pretty cool. Okay, so we now have this kind of cursor effect. You can even change the the scheme of the cursor yeah so like that so make it larger and um, i'm just gonna select it to the normal size to be honest and uh you can always enable it normally with the original one so now it's completely normal and this one link select i couldn't really find that in there um so let's see can we find that in there should we just type in link underscore select maybe is that gonna no no that didn't do it okay um you've got the classic cross which i've never even seen a cross i've never seen the cross what we can do you can change it to pen pen size and now that's oh no link select i didn't want that actually oh no uh yeah i meant this one this one you need to change to um that one you can even enable point of shadow so now you can see that kind of shadow effect Yeah, so you can enable this shadowy effect, and, um, let's see. Working in background, you can even change this, you can just press use default. There you go, you have the default one. Um, and yeah, those are the pointer options, you can even do, those are the po different pointers, that uh, pointer options. Select the pointer speed. whoa okay well uh so now it's really really slow and all you can do now you can do it halfway so it looks like this and it's really automatically move pointer to the default button in a dialog box that doesn't make sense um display pointer trails oh oh that does no that does not look good yeah you probably shouldn't do this because it looks really weird anyways goodbye hide pointer while typing yeah that's that's good enough uh, so you don't really need to change that uh wheel you can just you don't need to change that anyways 
but the pointers are the one we're talking about right now you can change every single one of these um to a different one you like 